Okay, yeah. So when Yahushua said um <clears throat> to Peter that Satan this desire to see you like wheat, seeing the Lord knew what he was he was seeing. And it's the same thing that what brothers have to take heed. Yahushua said, But I will pray for you. Yeah? And it's the same spirit that even us have to have. If you see a brother go off, you can't really turn your back at him. You have to try. Build him up back. Pray for that brother. When you consult um Galatians 6, he tell you that if you see a brother tempted, it's a restore such a one in the spirit of me is considering thyself. Because you, you can be tempted as well. So this thing, this thing is a two-way stream. It, we are not perfect in our shires yet as pertaining to the flesh. In the spirit, we know we know the scriptures, man. We have, we have spirits where I going to come to test you. You is your, your worst enemy in this truth. At one point, it used to be a woman. Then when you grow to a level, you become your worst enemy in this truth. You, you become your worst nightmare. Oh, if you abstain from certain lusts and all these things, you have to mortify your, your, your members, as the scripture said. Since brothers, you have to be careful um, on the part that you're walking now. You have to be sober. Things spiritual, man. Can you imagine how much time you wash I curse out Peter? Can you imagine if you pass Peter that walk up and down all the boy you wash on? Be a cuss cuss him a cuss cuss man. You would number you know, know, you know, among, among, amongst the twelve. Because ultimately, Satan, as we see it in the other door, I got to save him. I don't feel like he never get tempted. Seen? But Yahweh yeah, shall pray for him and, and heal him. It's the same attitude brothers have to have. Seen? Open rebuke is better than secret love, bro. See? Scripture? And it's Ephesians. Ephesians 5 and verse 15 say, Seeing then that he walk circumspect. Mm -hmm. Not as fools, but as wise, redeeming the time because the days are evil. And uh, clear to the point. Walk circumspectly. Look around. Seeing, be, uh, be, be so much more be spiritual. Seeing, because we're living in at the time now where if you walk in carnal, as the scripture says, if you walk after the flesh, he shall die. So now is the time, as we mentioned last night, uh, we are saying, oh, this, <coughs> the apostles say, oh, we're not supposed to like. <coughs> Follow up with a club, go clubbing and all them shit. And we say, look at this, a simple scenario, yeah? <laughs> no, you, you you go to the club. So this is just an example, yeah? So you go to the club and you was in the club, something happened. You hear say you end up as a witness. You never do not maybe maybe honestly you don't even see what really takes place. But you end up in an ESA court system now, uh, being a witness. Your 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 life now. You hear that this side of people want to kill you because you see, or you know, some, some stupid shit can happen. So, right now is the time as the brother bring up the scripture, you're supposed to be in circumspect. Always abounding in the work of the Lord, being sober, thinking, seeing. Always have an open mind for mercy as well, man. Seeing, because we ourselves need mercy from the Lord. So, always have that in your mind. Seeing for sure for mercy and to bring evil people in the world. Seeing you have to always um, reason with them with mercy because it 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 it's simple for the Lord to bring in anybody and kick your ass out. Seeing the scripture finish finish up that and then verse see. seventeen. Wherefore we e not unwise but understanding what the will of your power is exactly. Straight, uh, you finish. And be, and be and be not drunk with wine mm -hmm. wherein is it's excess, excess. Mm -hmm. but be ye full <laughs> with the spirit speaking to yourselves in in songs and hymns a spiritual song. and spiritual songs mm -hmm. singing and making melody mm -hmm. in your heart to the to the Lord so, Yahweh. Exactly. You to the Lord, you have Hashem, you have That is your main, main um, objective now. And if that's your main objective, you wouldn't stand off with brothers, man. See, you'll be at one with brothers. Because guess what? They are also servants fighting to obtain that same grace and that mercy. So guess what? You'd help. It, what scripture say? Iron sharpened iron. So a man sharpened the what? The countenance of his friend. See, it's a two. He says, if two are better than one, for if one fall, he will have the next one to, to build him up and lift him up. 
See? And, and at any time you yourself can be in the same position as a brother, brother with down. Can. You know you're gonna need the same mercy. Exactly. Yeah. So first Corinthians 9 and 27. But I keep under my body and bring it into subjection. Is that by any means which I have preached to others, I myself be a cast away. I will see that and times upon times. I'm a Shabahala. Seen. Barbarian Hornet. Sa um, um, Sarge. Yaradan. Yaradan. Seen. A um, <laughs> couple of man well. Seen. I've been, what, was always preaching to brothers. Was fervent in the spirit as well. Because me used to yeah. love listening to Amash Abahala. And Yaradan. The and Yaradan. Yeah, so I used to so. like, watch them like, yo, them brothers are in the spirit. But guess what? You have certain part of the, 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 the scriptures where you never marinate in the mind. Yeah. Seeing them just get deep. Deep in the scriptures, I get deep. I get some high knowledge. But some simple little things. The milk of the scriptures, the foundation, how to build your spiritual bone structure. Yeah. You build your character. It, it was a soak in. That's the reason why you, you, you think to, to, to supplant a brother for his money. Like oh, the IUIC are called um, the brother now, the pocket. The pocket. See? So they forgot everything else what the scriptures speak about how you deal with the brother. But they can't break down all the deep mysteries of the scriptures then, right? But, but, but you, you're going to take. But they are like Jordan, take better money to buy Jordan. Jordan collection. Yeah, in Jordan collection. See, you have to be careful. It's best if you know if it, it best if you know one or two of the most I love and you keep them than to know all of them and keep none. See, the scripture tell that in like, um, um, Sirach. See, so if it, whatsoever you know, Keep it, man. I try to apply it to the best of your ability. Yeah. So you will not bring out this bag of scripture, bring out this bag of scripture, but you not apply them to yourself. What what good is it to you, or what good is it for you? See, you have to check the spirit, bro. See, we all have to check our spirit and and, and see how how this what we are doing gonna benefit me. How is gonna benefit the brotherhood? Am I diligent enough towards brother? Am I? Um, trying to help brother as, as best as possible. Okay, See? Yeah, 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 exactly, first thing first. Me can testify of this. I've been in the last couple of situations. Um, well, well, I mean, a yeah, couple of times, well. And you have the brothers from England, uh, which I have never met any of them, save in Lakamar, which is not a part of the camp. But I've never met any of them in the flesh, and times upon times, Brothers bail me out. So how much more the men that are close by okay. every day? Yeah, I was say oh, you gonna love, love who you can't see. We, we can't scan. Uh, yeah, and you have your brothers running away I see every day. Oh yeah, it doesn't make any sense. See? It's a matter to achieve verse to achieve. It's a woe unto you, scribes and Pharisees, hypocrites. For you pay tithe of men and in honest and come in and have omitted the way to your matters of the law. Yeah, exactly. Judgment. Judgment. Mercy. Mercy. Faith. Faith. These ought he to have done and not to leave the other undone. Exactly, because guess what? It's when you all shall walk the earth, you all shall say, oh, him, him no come for condemn the world, but to save it. Meaning, right. what you all shall came to do, he said, they that be only not a physician. Right. You all shall is that, that chief physician which come to call that which were lost. So you all shall never come and be a friend and say, you sin so you're gonna be down. You sin so you're gonna be down. Y'all shall actually heal men that wasn't even a part of the elect. Showing his mercy and grace that is spread across the board. And leave room for Yahweh to, 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 to bring forth his judgment. Well, well it's exactly what is the same spirit is supposed to have. Mercy, judgment, and faith. Seeing and always put that thing called mercy on the forefront because as i said before ourselves need the tender mercies of your hour we need the sure mercies of david man as the scripture said um isaiah 53 saying we need that sure mercies of david just as how david commit a, a, a great sin unto death but guess what the lord still keep him a part-time fool and still exalt him that, that's the reason why I can dare now speak about King David and his great works that he had done. 
So it's the same thing we need, yeah? Go ahead. It's a uh, Matthew 5 verse 7. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's it. Get straight to the point, yeah? Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Mm -hmm. See? Mm -hmm. The scripture did finish it there, bring out? Huh? Okay. It's, a, it's a first Peter 2 and 17. It, say, <coughs> on, it says, On all men, love the brotherhood, mm -hmm. fear Yahweh, honor the king. Straight to the point. And all men love the brotherhood, fear Yahweh Bashem Yashai, love the king, man. See, straight, yeah. straight to the point. Go ahead. Says, Servants, be subject to your masters mm -hmm. with all fear, not only to the good and gentle, and gentle mm -hmm. but also to the forward. Simple. See, so, so this in itself brings forth humility, man. Humility. And trust me, Yahweh Bashem Yashai will exalt you. In due time. See, if, if you are supposed to be exalted, the Lord is going to exalt you. You know why? Give me the scripture in uh, Psalms uh, 74 or 78. Promotion. Oh, 75. 75. 75 and, 75 and 4. 75 and 6. Yes. I think you have, you have, you have said that about promotion. You have this, uh, this meme yeah. on the internet to say, oh, if you want for sure, um, I mean, say, oh, any man can endure hardship. Mm -hmm. But if you want to see a man true color, cool colors, yeah. give him power. Power, exactly. Really? Yeah, give him power, yeah. Come, come. So, and then you see our man react towards him, fellow. People when they run him. Come. I like your virgin when they kill and burn him up in our car. Come, come, come. When you grow together, so living at the same house, eat at the, eat at the same pot, and as soon as him get power and get money, right. all them friends mm -hmm. in, in cut off. Come. And a new friend them kill him. A new friend them kill him. You see that? So be careful what you're doing at the spirit, man. Go ahead. Psalm 75 and 6 for promotion come it neither. Give me give me our two verses up. Oh, All right. Psalm 75 and 5. Lift not four, four, four. four. I said unto the fools, mm -hmm. deal not foolish, mm -hmm. and to the wicked, lift not up thy behind. Right, you see that? You say unto the fools, deal not foolish, and to the wicked, lift not up thine heart. Don't feel proud, don't get puffed up, don't get mighty. See in God. Lift not up your heart and hide, <laughs> speak not with a stiff neck. Don't speak with a stiff neck. Don't feel like you're delivered. Don't feel like you're safe. And, oh, this man, you know, you know, you have a point on this brother. For example, I say, oh, your garment is not long enough. So you can't be a part of the elect. You know, just, just paraphrase. Just as I use a, a paraphrase, using an example. Saying, oh, how oh, you reach camp late two times. So you can't be a part of the elect. Doesn't work like that, my friend. See, it doesn't work like that. You have, to be, you have to be humble, man. Go ahead. For a promotion cometh neither from the east, mm -hmm. nor from the west, nor from the south. But Yahweh is the judge. He put it down one and set it up another. So the Lord Yahweh Bashem is the judge. And put it down one and set it up another. And you need to know this. All of us have our lots to pay. That, that, your lot is your lot. Nobody can take your lot. Likewise, you can't take a next man lot. See? You know, some gruesome things happen to certain people, and then you see a next man win the lottery. That's just their lot. Okay. And what is due, everything was prior in. What was due to you, you have okay. to you receive it. So just humble down. Just calm down. See? Flow in the spirit, man. Be humble. See, um, the brothers used to say, brothers them say in Texas, say, um, um, I'm a Shabala, used to come across, and the brothers them just sit down and relax. What you doing? You know, scriptures, scrip you know, just like being a tyrant in the spirit, man. No, it doesn't work like that, my friend. See, you have to know how to discern things, discern times, discern the, the, the environment. See, know how you deal with brothers, how you speak to brothers. See? Mm -hmm. So First Corinthians 13 and 2. And though I have the gift of prophecy. Can start, can start mm -hmm. can start one? Mm -hmm. First Corinthians 13 and 1. Though I speak with the tongues of man and of angels and have not charity, I am become as sounding brass mm -hmm. and of tinkling cymbal. Mm -hmm. And though I have give the gift of prophecy and understanding all mysteries and all knowledge, and though I have all faith, so that I could move remove mountains mountain. and have not charity, I am nothing. Mm -hmm. And though I bestow all my goods to feed the poor, and though I give my body to the burn, <coughs> and have not charity, I profited me nothing. Exactly, it profited me nothing. Charity, man. Charity in the spirit, man. Humble, humility. 
Just, brotherly love. Yeah, brotherly love. Just calm down, bro. See, just, just, as I said, this, this is for all of us, man. This is for every one of us. Just calm down. As, as, as young as a brother might be coming into the truth, a, a young brother supposed to can come to me and say, Mark what that. And it doesn't have to be about the scriptures, yeah? He can come and say, Mark what that. What do you think about this? Yeah? We're supposed to say, oh, 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 oh. Oh, my pastor, my pastor, you know, you know, show up yourself. But I come and say, what do you think about this? Or there was a situation at home, you know, any little thing, can just come, you're supposed to can just relax and come flow. Understanding the order. See, so you know, when I see your time, I say, yo, brothers, we are going to do this. You know, say, yo, that different. See, because you, you need to know to discern spirits at this certain time. But, but I was supposed to have flown as spirit being brothers, man. As as we mentioned, there was a little a slight little situation between three of us, me and two other brothers. We would never get puffed up or uh, curse out each other. Saying, we could call together a small council, and we have a seat around a table, and the three of us deal with it like civilized Israelite men. Not like black black Israelites, like civilized Israelite men. And we come to a conclusion and we try to sort out the problem. No. That's all you're supposed to leave, peace for the spirit to flow. And anyway, we have any closing scriptures, bro? Yeah, please. Since so we can close up, because I think we get to the point there. All right, this is um, Psalms 133, verse 1. It's a song of the grace of David. Behold, how good and how pleasant it is for a brethren to dwell together in unity. You know, long when you hear that scripture, bro? Done. Read it back again, Baba Kosha. Um, for <coughs> Psalms 133 and 1. A song of the grace of David. Behold, how good and how pleasant it is for a brethren to dwell together in unity. It is like the precious ointment upon the head that ran down upon the beard, even Aaron's beard that went down to the skirts of his garment, yeah. <laughs> as the dew of Hermon, and as the dew that descended upon the mountains of Zion, for there the Lord commanded the blessing even life forevermore. Exactly. So brothers are supposed to be doing you know what? Unity, man. Sin. In you saying, <clears throat> trust me, when, when brothers and brothers dwell together in unity, it's a, it's a, it's a blessing, man. I even hear, um, the liar Shwamba said, his father said he had never met so much young men together with that level of respect for each other. Saying, likewise, he vote here because one time we used to hear, say, brothers actually fighting in camp, so I'm like, one night, like, oh, is that possible? If, if the wicked, wicked among our people out here, whenever the one thing them always say about it, I want thing with them, them love them one another. If we buy a biscuit, it a share for all of them, one biscuit. Because they used to observe that when we sit, we used to sit in the park. Let me use all that, me use all that, me use all that. A female at the time used to come check me, and she would bring her food, and we take it. And everybody I eat. So my time I serve with serve here and give her about a little bit. And you know, and like like nothing. Seeing everybody just eat. Everybody dwell together in unity. Seeing? Anyway, I think that is the point. And we hope that this lesson has been an edifying one. And so we want to give our praises, glory and honor to Yahweh. Bashem Yahweh And double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Miss Stone. And to the brothers out there. Teaching is truth, man. Scripture said, Wolf, you're not supposed to make no other man take your what? Your crown. Saying so, fight the good fight of faith and hold firm unto eternal life. Hold firm to salvation unto Yahweh Basham Yahshai. Shalom.